And the caution well, is out. Coming into this race, Zane Smith, yes, and I'll continue that. Oh. John Hunter in the wall, Vince. Wow. Oh, boy. We talked about with John Hunter and Imacek just avoiding disaster today. And he has not, because that, my friends, is disaster. That was just the pace truck that went by. They're asking about water pressure. I hope there's enough duct, duct tape and bear bond to piece this thing together, but he's got to get it fired up. Yeah, I don't know about that, Kurt. Mm. And done. It won't run. Yeah, it won't that, run. I was going to say, that looks wonder, terminal. I wonder why it won't run. you got to do everything you can right now. Yeah. Give me a push. Something you can, yeah. What is wrong? It must be something electrical. Put his window net down and looked like initially was going to uh, climb out of the truck, but is Give me now asking for a push. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to. I want to do anything I can right yeah. now. Stay in it to win it. I don't know what led to this. But hopefully, we've got a good replay. Yeah. Woof. So trying to make the pass and then clipped by Austin Self in the 22. I mean, oh, John that's... Hunter went super low on the back straightaway. I mean, that was like four lanes down. And there just wasn't room to get back. And, he, you know, he roughed up Self right there. All right. And he sees him get loose off, too. So he's going to swoop to the inside. But Self wasn't really happy about the turn one situation. But that and almost that looked is, like a hook, didn't it? Yeah, it definitely <laughs> looked like a hook. That's uh, that's a bold move for somebody that's not up front a lot. Wow. And that was a big hit. But at the same time, Hunter Nemechek just needed to nurse those points and, and protect the, the plus 30 that he brought into today. Man, this is just a... Uh, well, it's a remember, bowl of soup here. Initial laps of the race, John Hunter tried to squeeze it in on Sheldon Creed and the team warned him, said just be calm, take it easy. Yeah, this is alphabet soup, I think. We gotta sort this out. Hopefully they can get it to pit road and, and give it a chance to get worked on and get on the five minute clock. And you, can't really, you, you can't really blame John Hunter for, for the, the tap into the back end of the 22. I mean, the 22 is slower. Can you? I mean, yeah. did he hit him too hard? I mean, I, that's Martinsville racing. Yeah. They're going to bump into people. But I, I it, it appeared, so we'll have to get another look at it, but it just appeared when they got to the corner. Man, it's just like if you poke the guy in the chest and then the other guy's like, no, oh, dude, I don't, I don't care for that. Then he kind of got loose off, too, and then the, the 22 obviously went out of his way to go find the four, but it's the initial contact that led up to the disagreement. And then we didn't see what happened for the four to get into the back of the 22 from the lap before that. Man, this is just getting, this has gone from bad to worse. Yeah, but still under these circumstances, I don't know about the, you know, do you, I don't think no matter how upset you might be, do you clip if you're Wayne Self, uh, Austin Wayne Self, do you? This is some huge contact. I mean, I don't agree with what Austin Wayne Self no. did there. But again, as a championship leader, somebody that's going for a run next week at Phoenix, you've got to do a better job of using your points to your advantage. Everybody's entitled to the same amount of racetrack. But I, there's always a time when I, I think you you got to make the prudent decision. Well, you you you. you bump and I'm some, not sure it was made in either case. There. Well, you you bump a guy and you race on. Yeah. You just wipe a guy out. Yeah. That's a different story. I agree. As every lap goes by, it just seems like the lap down cars now are passing Nemechek, and he's minus four, 33rd position. You've got guys that are five laps down, six laps down, eight laps oh, down. Oh, it's over. He's out. He, he's going to be losing at least four more points very quickly here. And only one truck is out of the race. So that makes it even worse for John Hunter. He's got to go to the medical center as any driver who is out of the race after contact. Who we saw the last race with Tate Fogelman, the guy who won the race, had to go to the medical center. We couldn't do the winner's interview until 20 minutes later. We were knocking on the hospital door. <laughs> Trying to get a hold of Tate. What an awesome finish it was at Talladega for that young man. Great racing. Oh, how frustrating it must be for John Hunter. I spoke with him this week and he 
He just said, we got to avoid disaster. He said the number one goal is just get to Phoenix with a chance to win the championship. And disaster strikes. Still got a long race, a lot of racing left. But uh, this is a real tough position to find yourself in. Yeah, I'm kind of at a loss for words. I mean, there's still so many scenarios that can play out. You know, Zane might not win. Uh, that might give an extra spot back. That's seven points that I'm seeing between Nemechek and Creed. It, it's uh, it's wide open right now. This this is that drama of the playoffs, and one little mistake like that changes a whole season's worth of work. That's what the playoff atmosphere is about, and it's tough. And that's Martinsville. <laughs> Great track to pick for your cutoff, right? Rubbins, Rubbins Racing, as we've heard. So you see that Nemechek currently sits plus nine. And we've seen crazier things happen. I mean, uh, some of these other guys could gift him. get knocked out. Definitely. And, it ain't over. I mean, it's not. It certainly doesn't look good for John Hunter, but it's not impossible that he could still squeak in. Let's watch this from the beginning. I think this will be the first contact. John Hunter bumps into the back of the 22. Down into turn one. Knocks him sideways. Falls back. The 22 gets loose. That gives John Hunter the run. Let's watch that yellow line, a white line, and see how much John Hunter didn't crowd up at all. Hey, race fans. Thanks for watching our video. For all NASCAR on Fox News content and the best clips from Fox Sports, be sure to follow and subscribe to our channel.